seeing you again very soon. And, of course, by very soon, I actually mean right now. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the next episode of the Legacy Challenge. Today, if all goes well, we will be seeing a birthday party for our little baby. Not her. Benjamin Jr. He will be becoming a toddler. It is a wonderful thing. So do you know how to cook at all? You can cook you can cook cereal, which isn't really cooking if you but whatever. You can prepare cereal, we'll say. We don't want anything to happen too early. So we're going to wait until about 4.30 or so. And then you can have cereal and you can wake up and paint. If you want to grow up well, you want a piano well, you're not going to have a piano for a while. And yes, you want to become friends with Chloe. That's exactly what you want. And while you are still going to sleep because you're so tired from yesterday, and no one has to work today, the birthday party should go off without a hitch. Uh, she still desires to get her into private school. But we're not going to try it. We're not going to risk that again right away. So why don't you... Um, eat. I wonder if you can talk to your dad even when you're over there and he's over there. All right. I guess not. That's okay. So she is going to chill out. He is going to be a bathroom user. Use the shower. <laughs> Actually, I'm just kidding. You're still hungry. Eat first. Then use. Then take a shower. And then, after that, you may clean up. Alright. And now they are eating together. Probably not for very much longer, because she's about done. Wait. Is she fat? She, she is fat. Oh, our little girl is fat. Reminds me of Olive from Little Miss Sunshine. Which is kind of funny because the actor playing her wasn't actually fat. They had to put some padding on her to make her look fat. Little uh, factoid there. So you are going to sleep until you wake up. And then you're going to do all that because we want to invite over her other little friend today. And of course we want to have our birthday party probably about noontime or shortly after. So, you're going to use the bathroom in there, which is all good. Everyone likes bathrooms. And you are probably about to wake up. Which is always a good thing. I like waking up. I prefer to wake up than not wake up, you know? Alright, she wants to have a birthday party. So yeah, go and eat and then use the bathroom. As for you, you know what? You've done this long enough. Oh, you can't work out? Okay, you're just going to have to be fat then until you're an adult. Cleaning up dishes is a way to burn calories, right? Oop, I had him cleaning already. I take out the trash. And then what you are going to do is call your friend Chloe. Uh-oh. Baby needs attention. Stop painting. Hold the baby. Don't run outside, even if I misclicked you. Uh, 
The Navy is not happy. Right, Bridget makes the call. We invite her over. Alright, sounds good. Meanwhile, put the receiver away. You change his diaper. Then feed him. Then put him back, I guess. Yeah, he really hates changing diapers, doesn't he? Yeah. Alright. Go I mean, I'm sure. Her. I'm sure it's gross because I've never had to do it myself, but. Nor have I, believe it or not. Uh, I was just going to ask that. Oh, Bone, that reminds me. Are you going to see uh, your cousin? Didn't your cousin have some uh, children recently? Oh, yeah. That was in December. They're almost a year old now. Oh, man. Didn't you say you were going to go to go see them at some point? I hope I will get to sometime. Do they live in the... Do they live in... Uh, the, do they live in Illinois? They do. Chicago area or the other part? Yes, they do. In the Chicago area. Oh man, that would be an interesting thing to go back there, wouldn't it? It would be a lot of fun. Oh man, if you do, you should tell me more about the whole experience, because I'm interested to hear about it. I will. Alright, so what are you interested in? You want to get mechanical level 3. That is what's going to make you happy. So I do decree, when we get to noon, it is going to be time to call out for the birthday party. You, you know one thing I really like about The Sims 2 and 3 as opposed to The Sims 1? What would that be? Oh, children can actually children can actually learn skills. I like that about them. Mm -hmm. It's much more realistic that way. Hey, and wow, she perfect. has gotten fat. I know. And there's no way I know if we get her thin, so she's just gonna be fat until she's a teenager. You could build a pool if you really wanted to, but could, but that's not really the uh, priority right now. Yeah. Maybe this house will have a pool in the distant future. I don't doubt that. It well, it'll be very lovely pool, too, I think. Uh, full of happiness and joy and bean burritos, especially bean burritos, man. Play that chess. Oh, wait, you randomly sat playing with your friends so you can play... Get a shower? Fine. Oh, let's invite Dirk Dreamer in. Why not? The TV's broken, so we're gonna have to call it Repairman. <laughs> Maybe the Repairman can be part of the birthday party. Yeah, the Repairman's always a nice addition. And Dirk Dreamer can be part of the birthday party, too. You know, why not everyone? Everyone can be part of the birthday party. Everyone's invited. And I don't know if she can even technically grow up today, too, because I keep seeing this, this grow up stuff for her, too. So, yeah, you could grow both of them up if you really want to and kill two birds with one stone, so to speak. Oh, right. So as soon as there's... So she's playing chess with the Dreamer Man. Alright, you... Now that you've done that, I don't think level 3 mechanical is enough to repair that. So call the service, and then... Um, oh, whoa, whoa, we're spinning around here. Dispose of that bottle. Ooh, what's that one painting we see? That looks cool already. Kinda Indeed. I'm curious what that's going to be. So, you are going to be done that. Whenever, um, whenever Hubby calls the repairman, you are going to call for the birthday party. Repairman. We need you to fix our ship. Throw party, birthday party. After he, uh, of course, cleans up. You can't, uh, you can't not clean up. You gotta have all the cleanness in the room. So, call him up. Maybe we have to invite Ben Grok, Richard Bugman, is our friends. And who else are we going to invite? Well, that's just like... Let's just click on random people. And there we go. That is our party list. 
And what you are going to do is serve some hamburgers. Who could possibly be calling? Bridget has a great party. Well, I guess Bridget is aging up today. In which case, you know what that means. Two tables, two cakes, I think. Isn't that right, Eric? Yeah, you'll need two cakes. You know, you should change that other table to a check to a chessboard one because it just looks so out of place oh, compared yeah. to the other one. Indeed. Well, we're gonna have food first. <laughs> Wait. The carpool for Athena will arrive in an hour. She doesn't work today, does she? Uh. Oh, she does. Oh well, she's not. Fuck it, do it live. <laughs> All right, so everything is going on. Is Benjamin available to talk? Whatever. Yeah, you can talk. Stop painting. Be a party pooper. A not party pooper, that is. <laughs> All right. So is anyone hungry? Fine, after you're done talking to her. After you're done talking to her, then eat. Are you full? Okay, you're not that full. You... Well, I can't make her look like that. Look on cake, do I? Is it not really? So it's not her birthday? I'm, I'm kind of confused now. Wait, what? It said that you could... Or bring Benjamin Jr. to the cake. At any rate. I don't understand. Wait, repairman, don't leave. We want you to be part of our party. Oh, he's already leaving. He's like, yeah, screw these people. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, the TV works. Yay! Hooray! So let's watch her, Reshi. Oh god, the nanny's here. Bring Benjamin Jr. to the cake. Mm. I was worried that the nanny was going to go pick him up and it would get all silly. Oh, that would be a disaster. <laughs> Bring to the cake. No, no work for you. Just cake. Huh. We don't Dude. care if you lose your job. You can afford a day off. <laughs> Benjamin Jr. Yes, and we are going to walk over, and we are going to have a party. A party for all the peoples. Alright. Speed it up a little bit. Everyone's going to come out. Oh look, baby's turning four apparently, there's four candles. <laughs> I remember candles mysteriously disappeared. Like she came out and lit them and she's like, nah, way too many, and just like threw a whole bunch away. Alright, well everyone is here, aren't they? All the boys are Ooh, look at that. A lot of people at this party. Yay! Yay. Oh, there we go. Nice work. Yeah. There we go. Oh, my God, Navi. Yeah, yeah, we're getting it going now. Okay. Let's see how it looks as a toddler. There he is. He looks cute. Moochie moochie. Aw, he looks so cute. <laughs> the police car drives away. <laughs> the police car is just like, I'm touched by this. I can't handle the emotions. I need to go. All right. To celebrate his arrival in childhood, it's time to put him on the potty. Yes. He's going to go to the bathroom. And can you... He's going to poop. <laughs> oh, and it always says clean up for the cake. But you know what? If we wait until after six, I think she might be able to... Um, Oh, you're right, we can. Once, once six o'clock rolls around, she totally can. Mm -hmm. So we just have to hang out. Oh no, she wants another baby. She wants <laughs> another baby already. Well, let's focus on getting the uh, train first. I mean, I've seen, I've seen party. a Sim have a, I've seen a Sim in The Sims 2 have a want for like 10 kids. I, I shit you not. Oh, lol. You, they, that would take a lot of elixir of life. Is he tired yet? No, he's not tired. He wants to play his xylophone, which used to be his big sister's xylophone. 
Yeah, I get rid of that stuff and then use the bathroom and take a shower. They don't really even need to shower that much. All right, so what you are going to do is, I don't know, watch TV or something. I'm just going to hang out a little bit. Invite these people to join you at the uh, TV watching area, otherwise known as the couch. And you are painting, but you are going to use the bathroom. Pick that maid right out. Alright. Maid is leaving. Ooh, there's a maid with a cake. Oh, she's taking care of the uh, paper. That is helpful. Oh, wait, so she's going to answer the phone. Oh, it was a pig. Oh, she just got insulted by the maid. The nanny? Yeah. The hell? Oh. Why? Maid, you, you're a horrible... You know what? No, fuck this. Fire her! Why That's not called for. Why is she doing this? Like, this is this huge, like, this shows up. No, shows you know up. what? No, don't let, don't let her take this. Fire her immediately. We gotta fire her. Let her go. Even if you hire another one that looks identical, fire her. Oh, well. <laughs> and now what's she doing? Let's just talk it now. Everything's fine. Oh, well, she wants attention from her... He wants attention from his daddy, I think, right? Being tickled by Benjamin. So come on over and uh, play tickle. Put the tongue in your telephone and don't pay any attention to the stupid maid. Pay no attention to the maid behind the curtain. Why the maid is behind the curtain is another question. No, no, don't pay attention to the no. Oh god, unhand me, unhand me. I should bring him. I should put him in the high chair. You gonna feed him? What's going on here? Why is the birthday party a snoozer? This is a great birthday party. What are you talking about? Oh, it's not bad. This was a little bit of time to go. And Randy is taking a bath. Alright, oh he's eating. He's doing the nap lines. Then tickle him. Oh, Bridget will grow up in just one day. How about she grows up now? Blow out candles. Are you ready? It is going to be birthday time for little Bridget. In her full denim stuffs. Yay! The birthday party was fun. Even though it's not over. Because, whoa. Because she is going to be... Oh, here we go. Having her birthday party. Well, at least there's one person out there to celebrate with her. Maybe more will come. Oh, he's leaving. She's leaving. Oh, well, screw them. Oh, poor her doesn't even care. Yay! The side of the house is very white. Yay! Oh, and here she comes. I think. And... Ta-da! Yay! She is a 
teenager now. Koya indeed. Alright. And now it is time to decide our aspiration. Remember, one is popularity, two is family, three is romance, four is knowledge, five is fortune, and six I get to pick. So, we have one. She is a popularity sim. And she is going to have some cake. There she is. Nom 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 indeed. Have some cake. Really, it's okay. Ah, oh, Bridget. It's a wonderful thing. All right, Bridget. Congratulations on becoming a um, a teenager. Now do your chores. All right. As for you, uh, let's see. Yeah, you're already doing your chores. And you, as a proud mom of a teenage daughter, how's baby? How's it doing? Sleeping? All right. So you. How's your body looking? I say it's time to work out. I'm back and I'm trying most important things. <laughs> Indeed, Bridget is now a teenager. Look at her. There she is. Okay. Oh, she looks a lot better. What aspiration did you get for popularity? Popularity, indeed. That's what you rolled? Yep, that's what I rolled. Oh, yeah. So tomorrow morning she goes back to school. Bubba goes back to work. And hopefully it will not suck. Come back here and paint, because you do desire to get the best popularity aspiration. I mean, paint the best popular... Yes, good stuff. And meanwhile, Athena is exercising because she doesn't want to be a big fat fatty forever. Is her daughter She's still fat. fat? Are you still fat? Yes, you're fat. Oh, well, you get thin to her. It's kind of funny because you don't even notice that much, or at least I don't notice. But she needs... It was much more noticeable when she was a kid. Yeah, she needs to get the um, that stuff done. Uh, right. And Benjamin Jr. is sleeping. And he's probably going to grow up with a default hair cut, cut too, we're going to have to give him something different, you know? Yeah. Meanwhile, husband and wife, now with teenage daughter, working on their skills happily. Or grumpy. Yeah, I, bet, I bet these parents are starting to feel old. Mm -hmm. so they have a teenage daughter. So what do you think? Should I just give it as the four of them? I mean, you know what? I would say yes. I don't see any pressing need to too much. What's this? Bridget is an overachiever. Maybe she will be, but don't hold your breath. Don't, don't rush it out before. Oh, wait, painting complete? Let's look at it. Oh, it's like a postmodern thingy. $256. Nice. The thing is, I'm going to keep that because it's neat looking. So, how are you? You are doing... Well, you have to work tomorrow. So, I'm going to call it an early bed for you. As far as your wife, she is going to take a shower, and she is going to join you in the bed. Stupid nanny's still there. Hate that nanny. What are you talking to him for? I'll be annoyed. Shoo. That nanny's a bitch. No, you don't get to use the shower. What are you doing? Get out of there. You creepy nanny. <laughs> All right. So, you are going to bed. 
and you are going to sleep. And you know what this means, right, Eric? That means we are at the end, the of, the episode. end of the episode. And join us. We want to thank you very much for watching, and join us next time.